Hi, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Paddy Donovan and I'm the chairman of the Hong Kong Rugby Union. This is the first in a series of topical updates that I plan to provide to the community in Hong Kong. Firstly, I wanted to reconfirm the Hong Kong Rugby Union's commitment to the 15s program. There's been a lot of change recently, as we all know, but we have been very pleased to secure the services of Simon Amor as the head coach of the 15s program through to the conclusion of the Asian Rugby Championship. This is the first step in our campaign to qualifying for the Rugby World Cup in France. Simon has recently been involved in the England setup with Eddie Jones. He was the England attack coach, and again, we're delighted to have secured his services. He needs no introduction to Hong Kong, as he has played for England, captain England, and actually coached them as well to Olympic glory. James Fanden is also joining us as the new general manager of performance. James has an excellent resume in high performance sport. He's also a very experienced coach in his own right, uh, having been involved in the England setup, Loughborough uh, and England students. James will be working with our 15s program, 7s program, men and women's, and will also be looking at our under 20s uh, academy and uh, international program. He'll work closely with the performance clubs and CCOs as well. I was personally delighted to see the calibre of people putting themselves forward for these top positions in Hong Kong rugby. It shows that we're still well regarded within the international community and we can secure the services of great individuals. We also have a number of new CCOs coming in to support the clubs and they're a strong and talented bunch. Now secondly, as you're all aware, the union has gone through some very tough and challenging times with the unrest and COVID. The board have re-looked at our strategic plan and we've decided that we want to double down on our homegrown talent and local development. There'll be more to come with announcements of academies and how our mini and youth programs will seamlessly interact and then lead through into senior rugby and ultimately for those kids to be playing for Hong Kong in the future. And thirdly, I'd like to congratulate our men's and women's sevens team uh, as they've just competed in the Olympic qualifier series in Monaco. They both performed extremely well. Unfortunately, the men lost to Ireland, the eventual uh, Olympic qualifiers, and our women's sevens team did incredibly well competing against France in their final. Unfortunately, it wasn't to be, but it ha they have learnt a lot from the experience and it stands us in great stead in the years ahead. And particularly next year, when we look to qualify again and compete and gain medals. I look forward to catching up shortly. We have a great program set up over summer for both boys and girls in our junior programs. We also have introduction to rugby for adults. Our new season will start in September and we're really looking forward to another great season ahead.